Oh, check out my new pupper. Hi, pupper. What are doing? What are doing? Oh, this is Sammy. Say hi, Sammy. That's my pupper. And she's gonna hang out with me everywhere I go. So you'll probably see her in some of the videos. Well, here we go. It's been 24 hours since I put the rust treatment on. Um, everything's dried and cured overnight. It's a, it's a nice day for painting also. So I've got all these parts and pieces that are left on the back end of this truck to paint. All the U-bolts and U-bolt plates and brackets. I'm just gonna get the Scotch-Brite and everything, cleaning it up and paint it up. So I'm gonna bring y'all along and show you what we got. And we're back. I got everything cleaned up, sanded, scotch brighted, and I'm gonna paint. I'm gonna paint all this stuff. It looks like the cold front's gonna be coming, so today is the day for all of these parts to get the paint on them so we can put this rear end of this truck back together. Hopefully our front bushings will be here today or tomorrow, and we can get that front end tore apart. And that's the end of this chassis after that front end's done. So the truck's coming along nicely. There's still a few detail things I need to do, paint some heads of bolts, um, clean up some lines and line clamps, but overall this thing's coming together real nicely. Then the engine's gonna start going in and that's gonna be a real fun part because I know very minimal about this end of it. It's not my thing. I like making them look good, making them go. I really don't know. But we're gonna learn as we go. So you guys hang out with us, catch up, and uh, see what we got going on. We'll keep bringing you this content. Y'all have a good one. What's going on everybody? We got parts in for the 84. So today I'm going to try to get these parts put on the truck so I can paint these control arms and spindles. And that's the last piece of the chassis restoration side of this job. We are going to get new bushings, ball joints, inner and outer tie rods, idler arm, pitman arm, all that in the front will be brand new after today. So I'm going to start taking all this stuff apart, try to get it cleaned up, bushings in, and put it back together with paint. So it'll take me at least another day for paint, depending on how easily these bushings go in, but I'll bring y'all along and show you what I'm doing. What's up everybody? Another day here at the shop. Uh, we got Chase over here in the Kona. What you doing Chase? Uh, I am ordering the LMC parts for this truck right now. We got set up with LMC and now we're a shop with them and we're ordering all the new door panels and uh, carpet and dash, all sorts of stuff. It's gonna be a nice truck, huh? Yeah, it's gonna be nice. I'm pretty pumped about it. It's gonna be a cool truck. We've been super busy and um, I feel like I've went ahead on some steps here. So I'm gonna show you what we've gotten done on the truck so far and tell y'all what we've got planned for the day. So we'll bring y'all along and show you what we got. So we got the new gas tank from Auto Metal Direct installed with the new fuel pump, EFI tank, repainted everything for that. Ready to rock and roll for the fuel system in the back. The rear end, leaf springs, everything's all painted. Then we've got our front suspension parts, all of our bushings in, spindles painted, cleaned, dust covers, ball joints, everything ready to go on the truck. All of our front suspension's ready to rock and roll. So today's plan, we're gonna get this front suspension installed on the truck and get it back on the ground. We got a bunch of stuff to do all over the place. It seems like it never ends, but y'all come along. 
watch us get this front suspension put back together and make this truck a roller again. All right, guys. <laughs> uh, we got some progress going on the truck. We've got all the arms and spindle and steering and spring and blah, blah, blah on. I worked so hard putting this together. You know, it probably took me an hour to get done, but I did it finally. Uh, took a wrench and uh, a screwdriver and put all this back together. Russell's looking at me like you're crazy. We got to take the bearings up to the parts store for the rotors. Oh, look what I got in my back pocket. Your phone. Ooh, no, that's not my phone. But oh, shop phone. We've yes. Got bearings. There's the bearings. Uh -huh. But they make two different sizes, so we need to be sure which ones we got. So we're going to take those up there, and then that'll be the last part of the install on this truck. So y'all keep up. The end of the day. The end. The end. We're done. We got this front end on this. Wait, did you get both sides done? I just filmed that side. So you got both the front end put together. We need to paint the calipers, put the new brake pads in, and do our touch up on bolt heads. Paint these shims? No, I'm not gonna paint the shims because they're still gonna have to align it at some point. Ah. I'm gonna leave all these shims and those bolt heads unpainted because that POR 15 is so thick. It'll, yeah, I got you. So once they do the alignment, then we'll touch up the shims or maybe even make a shim that looks nicer than those since we'll know our thickness. But we got the whole front end back together, all new bushings in it, ball joints in it, steering's on, everything. Put the motor in and crank it up and just drive off. You wanna do that right quick? Let's do it. We're gonna do that right quick. Well, what do you think about the truck so far? I'm ready to drive it. Are you ready to drive it? Yes. It's gonna be fun. We thank y'all for watching. We appreciate everything. Um, we're just trying to do the best job we can do on this truck. And this truck is for sale. So if you wanna buy it, By the time you see this, it'll be on the road. Yeah, this sucker's gonna be driving. Yeah. So if you wanna buy it, hit us up, send us a DM at the Journey HQ. You can find us on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, and right here on YouTube. Just send us a DM if you're interested in purchasing this. It's going to be around, I don't know what I'm going to say it's going to be. It's going to be around dollar signs. Dollar signs is what it's going to be. <laughs> it'll be the perfect platform for somebody to either drive it just like it is, because it'll be a great grocery getter, or go the next step on it and get a paint job. Yeah. So, yeah. Do so, what makes you happy. Do what makes you happy, because we are. For sure. Are you? I'm doing exactly what I want to be doing. Me too. All right. Stay tuned for the next one. Holla!